Hi, I'm Tammy and this is Tammy's Ordinary Life. And today I want to talk about why I hate Halloween. And it is coming up in 11 days. It is the worst holiday that anybody could imagine. Yes, I've heard the history of all the different histories about why Halloween is, why it is. But I personally do not like getting the shit scared out of me. And I have different reactions to when I get the shit scared out of me. As a wheelchair-bound individual, if you get too close to me, I'll start swinging. However, I also carry something that quite possibly could put a hole in you. And that's all I'm going to say about that. So I just advise people, also, don't scare the shit out of me. I, I don't. I don't get it. I I uh, was at the dentist the other day, and this is what made me think about my video today. And they were all talking about how they were all going to dress up as Care Bears. Okay, that's cute. I don't mind if you dress up as Ninja Turtles or, or Batman and Robin or Superman. It's the... Well, if you've seen my video from a year ago, I told you about the Haunted Hayride. And so anything involving chainsaws, knives, axes, even weapons that can put holes in you, I just quite personally don't think that that should be any part of a costume. I mean, okay, say you guys, you know, the Top Gun Maverick came out a while back and you guys want to be Tom Cruise. Personally, he's not the guy I'd want to be, but, you know, to each their own. I just want to say that there probably are others out there like me. When I posted this on Facebook about a week ago, somebody even said that would be horrible for somebody to scare you because how do they know you don't get anxiety attacks? And I do get anxiety attacks and I do get anxious about that. I'm kind of like how they warn dogs, you know, to take care of your dogs during the fire works during 4th of July. I'm that dog except for it's Halloween and it's like thankfully we live out in the boonies where we don't get any trick-or-treaters but I also grew up in the period where they started putting razor blades in our apples and started poisoning our candy and I very seldom went trick-or-treating anyway because I'm a ranch girl I was raised in Wyoming so we very seldom unless we stayed at a friend's house who lived in town I think that was what less than a handful of times um, there was one time in high school I went to, um, they had a haunted house at the old police station. That's when I discovered I was claustrophobic. I, anyway, that was a whole nother story. It's kind of like the hayride story. It's just like, you for, I forget I'm doing something and then all of a sudden I discover I'm claustrophobic and I'm like in self, and I wasn't wheelchair bound then, so I was like in like panic mode get out of my way you know because well i don't know if any of you ever have been claustrophobic but it's mm, right up there with panic attacks so i would like to advise people to be cautious about the people around you that you don't really know because they could be like me and not like this holiday because they don't like getting the shit scared out of them so I hope this helps anybody who feels the same way I do about Halloween. Um, God help us all in 11 days. <laughs> I don't like even going into the stores where they have these spooky things. And I'm not even, I'm, I'm on a track to go get whatever I'm at the store for. And I happen to wheel by whatever it is. And it's like, ah, and I'm like, and I have a scream that's worse than the Janet Lee scream in the shower scene in Psycho. So imagine hearing that when you're in Walmart or Target or whatever grocery store you're in and you hear the, that scream. Lots of people come running towards the scream to see why, and it's because whatever scared me. So yes, um, I feel for you out there, for those of you who are also scared of Halloween, of the stuff that's going around on Halloween. Not the cute little stuff. Like Care Bears. I mean, everybody just dressed up as Care Bears. <laughs> or Smurfs. I don't care. But don't scare the shit out of me. And 
please follow me at TammyKeys710 on Instagram. Everything else is in the description box. I'd really love it if you like this. And I'd even love it more if you subscribe. And I will talk to you later. See you next time. Bye.